Hey everyone, Yeti Punk here, pop culture's extraordinaire. Coming to you today with an extra special video from a recent haul that I picked up. One thing about me is I love Looney Tunes. Anything Looney Tunes, I'm kind of a sucker for. It's my weak spot. It's something I've always enjoyed with um, since I was a kid. I've enjoyed it with my kids and uh, it's just something that is extra special to me for many different reasons. But part of that haul that I picked up actually came with vintage uh, Pez dispensers. And for anyone that doesn't know, Pez dispensers are a candy dispenser that you'd put block candy in. You'd pop them in there, put them down, open it up, and it would dispense a candy for you to take out. Now these, I, I picked up some mint and package as you can see, but, um, they're basically all from the 90s, I would say from 1993 to about 1995. Um, we have all different characters, so we'll go on the loose ones first. Here we got a normal Taz with the yellow base, as you can see here. Um, he is 1995, that says? Yes, 1995. He's in really good shape. Um, Pez isn't really something I collect, but hey, if it's got Looney Tunes on it, I'm all down for it. Um, we have a Sylvester here, just a normal, cool-looking Sylvester. Um, he is 1995 as well. Some of these are 1995, 1993, um, and uh, none of them are in the 2000s, or even like 1998, I would say. So... These are very cool. They're in really good shape, surprisingly. Um, the, the person that I, I got them from, he runs a collectible store and that, and uh, he got in a whole big bunch of Pez dispensers, all different ones. So I went through and I grabbed all the Looney Tunes ones out. So we got Bugs Bunny. These all work as well too. Um, some of them are a bit more faded than other ones. Um, as you can see here, we got Sylvester with his cool glasses on. Cool sunglasses. I wear my sunglasses at night. Yeah, 1998. So these, yeah, that's, I think this is about the newest one. But he's a little stiff to open up. Some of these are a little bit stiff, but other than that, they all do work. We have a Daffy Duck, of course. Uh, it's got a little mark on it. His... Um, bottom dispenser is it's a bit aged so it is a darker blue I don't know if it's coming up properly on camera but it is a darker blue but really good shape um, they had a couple different Tweeties there now this is where we're getting into the old ones here this is yeah the one on this the date so the date on Tweety is from 1988 he's one of my older ones now the thing with Tweety is you got to watch these ones is the hair on it is very brittle there was other ones there that were missing the hair <laughs> I'm like I'm not paying for broken hair like I want Tweety to look like Tweety <laughs> so you know but for this Pez dispenser from 1980 this is in really great shape you know a lot of these when you do get Pez they're only used once and then you know it's pretty much it but you know, they, they stand up. You don't know. <laughs> but um, the coolest one I got, and I didn't even know it when I picked it up. I just like, that's a different looking Daffy. This one is from 1978. Or sorry. Yeah, 1978. Sorry. The light was, it's hard to read the little uh, dates on them, you know, as you get older and such. But um, I noticed this Daffy. I'm like, he, he looks a lot different from the other ones. So I picked him up. But for a Pez Spencer from 1978, this is really great shape. Very happy to have uh, uh, pretty much any merchandise, Looney Tunes. I try to get old as I can. Um, obviously from my era. But <laughs> I, I do enjoy the older stuff. I just think it's really unique. So as you can see, the difference between the Pez dispensers over the years, you know, as you can see here, but you can still tell it is a Daffy. 
my wife looked at it and is like, it almost looks like a crow. And that's just because of the plastic that they used. It was totally different at the time for these. So you can, you can tell, you know, you go to Sylvester, that's from 1998. And you can... You can tell the plastic is, is totally different. You know, the handles are different. And of course, like the way they wrote Pez on it is completely different. Sorry, I'm not getting this into focus, but yeah, anyways. So he also had a lot of bagged ones there. So <laughs> I managed to pick those up. These come in the original candy. So we got a brown, uh, brown stem, I guess brown stand, uh, Taz, which is really cool. Now he comes with grape and strawberry candy, which, uh, in the comments below, what was your favorite, uh, flavor of Pez? I always like grape, big grape fan. One of my favorites that I picked up was, of course, Speedy Gonzalez. He comes with a grape and this is a tropical flavor oh no this one is a strawberry one as well but yeah he's in bag i'm not opening up these ones so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to find a way to display them all but i still want to just show them off now this is a bag version of a daffy it comes with a grape and an orange flavored so this is just the exact same one obviously mint and mint and package a mint and bag however you want to say it um, this is a different Taz. He's got a uh, almost like a fluorescent kind of stand with his. And as you can see on the head, it looks a little different. He's wearing a bicycle helmet, just like your normal bicycle helmet. So I had to pick them up. Anyways, a very cool lot. Happy to have them, especially my oldest here. You know, we got 1980 and 1978 Pez dispensers. I really, really love these. Uh, comment down below, what's your favorite flavor of Pez? And what is your favorite dispenser that you saw here today? Thank you everyone for tuning into this video. And uh, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. I'll see you on the next one.